The microbes, uh, there's actually microbes that live in the asphalt the and they are probably eat. eating some of that uh, soft tissue as well. Um, and all that, yeah, all those gases that are coming up are naturally occurring. Most of it's probably from uh, the geology itself, uh, but there's also a bio, uh, biogenic uh, factor from these microorganisms that are eating the asphalt or maybe soft tissue and then expelling methane and uh, hydrogen sulfide. So hydrogen sulfide is a smell that you guys are smelling out there. It smells like rotten egg. Um, uh, but, yeah. but do we know what type of microorganisms can be? Uh, there is a poster, I think that's on that wall, uh, but we do have bacteria, archaea, um, all the testing, many different uh, species. Um, and I'm sure even more than uh, the that sample that they took uh, it is. But honestly, uh, I think more research needs to be done about those microbes. What are they? Now that we know which ones are kind of in there, at least some of them that are in there, what are they doing in that space? Um, that's something I can't answer right now. Then the animals feel like they're in high school. Yeah. Um, how about? It's stuck in high school. Yeah. 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 It's exactly. For the rest of their life, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Um, so, uh, what else? I have about three minutes to talk. Um, do you have a question? Are these the same kind of animals that were migrating in China Lake and other parts of the Uh So, you're talking about the uh, population um, densities and distributions and things like that. Unfortunately, I don't know exactly what is the age of uh, the China Lake specimens. Do you know? Are they 10 to 50,000 years old? If they're not 10 to 50,000 years old, the odds are it's not the same population kind of thing. But if, uh, um, there were definitely waves of lots of different animals, uh, including mammoths, and they were also interbreeding. So woolly mammoths and clumpy mammoths, we know from uh, uh, genetic evidence that they were actually interbreeding. Just like uh, a lot of, there's a paper that recently came out about humans, not here, but uh, in, in uh, Europe. In Europe. Uh, the Neanderthals, Neanderthals. Homo sapiens, which is what we are, Homo sapiens, which means why? Yeah. 